Hola amigos, your boy QEP, Heather Hertz, here for another infamous trailer reaction. Uh, we have a Demi Moore horror film fresh off the presses that we just got in. It's called The Substance and Mubi, whoever Mubi is. I thought that's like an app. Mubi's doing movies. Uh, let's is check this trailer. M-O-O-B or Mubi? M-U-B-I. Mubi. Never heard of them. I, I, it sounds like an app. So I guess like an app. But there's two movies getting into movies now. I wonder if it's two bees saying that they're making movie like movies, like it's two bees movies, which is great because you know who owns Tubi? Who? Rupert Murdoch, who owns Fox. <laughs> okay, now that has me like, why am I promoting a Rupert Murdoch production? Let's find I didn't out. What I didn't know about that until like until like two months ago and I was just like god damn it Tubi put, puts out good stuff now I can't watch it anymore it makes me feel some kind of way Heather yep. it makes me feel some kind of way uh, we already into this we're a couple minutes into this let's let's see what we may or may not promote Heather here we go the substance y'all or the Murdoch family owns it I'm sorry okay have you ever Murdoch is old as fuck so a better version of yourself younger more beautiful, more perfect. Should always smile. Okay. Color me intrigued. Okay, I'm actually, you know, I'm I'm very curious on this one. What do you think, Heather? I'm I like it. I, I I love Demi Moore. Um, it's very interesting. I'm trying to see if if Mubi is related to Tubi. Okay. Um, no, it doesn't look like it. it. Looks it looks like this is a European, like a, an in, not European, an English production company. Which is okay. So I feel a little bit better. I feel, feel better. Bit yes. Better. Um, yeah. I I it looks it's so it's it's another body horror. Uh, I yeah. I feel like we're getting a lot of body horrors lately. Yeah. Um, not to say I love to be more and what's in, what, what is so fascinating to me? And I'm just gonna say this because we also did something, um, we did, we did, we've done a couple lately where we've seen these really famous actresses going back with, you know, years and years, decades of, of filmography. A lot of them started in horror because one of the great things about horror is that that's where so many actors and actresses start these indie, these indie horror films that give them their beginnings. And it's almost like we're going backwards where we're seeing a lot of actresses, especially actresses, some actors, but a lot of actresses who are going back and doing horror or are going or kind of going and trying those horror genres. So I, I'm i curious at the same time. I also feel like this is something we've seen before. I'm not going to deny it. So, yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm very intrigued. That kind of grabs me. Um, mm -hmm. I'm a fan of Demi Moore. Dennis Quaid. <sighs> really have a love-hate relationship with that guy now used to be real fan of his but his politics have kind of swayed me from him uh but director screenplay writer corley fargeet uh mm -hmm. she's also editor so this looks you know uh very interesting um yeah so uh stay tuned y'all i may have some more thoughts and maybe a screening invite came my way which provoked this so uh probably definitely have some initial thoughts coming out of that and uh We'll see if we'll have a full review as well. But uh, mm -hmm. The Substance uh, dropping on September 20th, uh, coming to theaters. And it won breast... Breast? Breast? Breast, huh? Breast. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh. It won Best Screenplay at the 2024 20, Con Film Festival. Uh, so, okay. I have a lot of respect for cons. So okay. uh, let's see what's going on with that. All right, y'all. Those are our vibes. Let us want to know what you think of substance on the substance in the comments below. Heather Hurt, your boy KUP.